Just a really quick video. As uh, most of you know by now, that <laughs> I can't, I can't, I can't make a video about the Knicks without laughing. They're laughable. They're laughable. It's hilarious. The hilarity of the Knicks. It just every time you think they can't get lower, every time that you think you they've hit rock bottom, they amaze you in the fact that they can actually go lower. So the whole Porzingis deal for Dennis Smith Jr. and DeAndre Jordan, Wesley Matthews, I didn't see anything about draft picks in here. Now, I'm going to try to look at this from a positive perspective. I know my man Chris is upset. That's his guy. I get it. But Porzingis, listen, man, he was great. You know, he he he's awesome. He's a great player. He's young. He's coming into his prime. And I don't like to see players like this go. I honestly don't understand the move. Unless the Knicks do plan on making a run at Anthony Davis, or they plan on making a run at Kevin Durant or some of these other high-priced guys in the league. It doesn't make any sense. But to me, maybe that's what they're doing. Maybe the Knicks have got to get out from underneath it, and maybe this is what you have to do is just make a blockbuster deal that doesn't seem to make any sense. I mean, really, we can't be any worse than we've been. He's been here, and we haven't won anything anyway. We don't know how he's going to be coming off his knee injury. And he may never be the same player. I mean, I'm trying to look at this through the most positive aspect I possibly can. Again, the Knicks haven't won anything since he's been here. And sometimes you've got to make a blockbuster deal. I know, buddy. Can you believe that they traded Chris Thompson for Zynga? It's just crazy. It's freaking nuts. It's nuts. Um, so, anyway, I mean, maybe that's what they're doing. Listen, I look at the... I, I'm going to equate it to this. In 2004... The Boston Red Sox traded arguably their best player and no more Garcia Parra for Orlando Cabrera and a couple of nothings, okay? And everybody in Red Sox Nation sat there and said, Oh, my God, what in the hell are we doing? How can you trade Nomar for nothing? We got nothing back. They went on to win the World Series that year. Now, I'm not saying the Knicks are going on to the finals this year, okay? But maybe sometimes it takes a move like this to get a team out of a funk to just show that nobody's safe. I honestly don't know. But then again, I haven't known anything about the damn Knicks in 18 years because who knows? We're garbage. I'll be right over there, buddy. So they're garbage. I just wanted to make a quick video. I know Chris already kind of covered this, but I just wanted to give my perspective on it. And like I said, hopefully this is just something to get us out of this. I really don't know what the deal is. Hopefully this is a, because they're going to run a, make a run at KD, make a run at AD, make a run at some other big price free agents, and they're going to go in a different direction. Because Lord knows the direction we've been going in the last 18 years has been the wrong direction. And we're a pathetic laughing stock. Maybe this changes things. I guess only time will tell. Bad dog, I'm out. Peace!